Hey YouTube, what's up? It's Kizzy and welcome back to more Xenoblade Chronicles Blind Part 2. As we left off, we watched a intro movie that was really cool. And then we entered this Grand Canyon world of Xenoblade Chronicles. I'm starting to get a feel for the game and how it works. I found Dunbar's house. Is that like a part of the thing or is that built on it? I'm there's such crazy structures and stuff. I'm just looking around. And I've get I've gotten great feedback. It seems everyone's excited for this game. It's a very popular game. I've seen and heard. How do I get into his house? Can I jump? Yes, I can. <laughs> you know what I something I noticed I was running around. If like if you run and turn the camera, it seems like he goes super fast. Let's see if I can do it. Damn it. It's not working anymore. Eh. Maybe that was just my mind playing tricks on me. No, there it goes. Like it looks it just looks like you go much faster. Uh can I go in here? It's just L and R to target over and over again. I guess I can't go in here. Maybe I should just follow the gem for now. So this game actually has like a day night cycle? That's pretty cool. I think that's a actually a really cool feature in games, especially like open world type RPGs. Like any type of open world. Nighttime! It straight up just says nighttime. Oh! One downside to that, though, is it's gonna be like Grand Theft Auto style, or like, oh, to do this mission, you must come here between 3 and 5 p.m. We close at 6 on weekends. Oh, I'm sorry, what just happened? Landmark and light? What? Did I just get experience for coming here or something? Welcome, you can buy and sell anything here. People, too? Uh, well. uh, so, buy? Uh, it's gonna be a while to learn this game. Whoa, buying items. Select the item you wish to buy, per se to buy it. Press LR to select character, display what their stats would be with the item equipped. Remember to equip purchased items, selecting change equipment in the menu. Uh, so, it just gives you, like, a percentage my block rate would be plus three percent. How do I cycle through? I guess uh, you have to go to the top, and then it goes Bone Upper. It's a good name. I get a nine cap. So if I bought this, my strength would stay the same. No, my defense. What is my defense right now? Thirty-one and thirty-eight. If I bought this, it would both go up by one. <gasps> I have three thousand. G is is gold the standard of this game quit thank you please come again okie dokie so you walk by people and then their little speech bubble pops up calling nine resident get your ether lamps 50 percent off nothing sets a romantic mood better well. buy one of these fabulous lamps it'll brighten up any home good quality products just like the ones that light up the colony in stock, but going fast. 50% off. Uh, can I not actually, like, purchase from you? I guess not. I wanted to get a romantic... <laughs> oh, God. I'm just gonna see that popping up everywhere. I'll be like, wait, wait, what was that? Who's trying to talk to me? Hello, resident. When it gets this late, it's really ravenous. Monsters come out. You better be careful if you're going outside the colony, so... Different monsters at nighttime makes sense. You can also get some rare items if you defeat them. Okay, okay. Learning, learning. So I'm, I'm wondering if this is gonna be like a. I don't. I wonder how many places you could actually go inside. You know, kind of RPG. But I heard this. I it seemed. What the hell is that thing? This is a colonial resident. Your lovely, fresh nopon veg. Oh God. Friends ever trade before? Be very best at trading. Stuff that hard to find on own can't buy from shop. Easy peasy, friends can just trade it for easy. If friends find person who like to trade, friends should try it out. That's right. Ooh, hey girl. What's up? Well. They pun are just cute. They have good business acumen too. So those are no pun or napun or napun. And they show up at the most unexpected places. 
There's nowhere on Bionis that you won't find a boss. Okay, I'm getting, I'm getting, um, oh god, I'm getting Mass Effect. I've, I'm a huge Mass Effect, or I should say, I was a gigantic Mass Effect fan. I loved the first game, second game, and 90% of the third game. And it's, I'm getting vibes of that running around the Citadel, talking to every single alien on that ship, just like, hey, what's your life story, Shepard? <laughs> Uh, let's just actually f Okay, so Oh, I just got more experience. Hey, man, listen here a bit Seven The thing is a little weird Hello there youngin. I got something that might interest you Something to tell you it's about this here furnace creatures die Crystals everyone knows that don't they sure I do that uh, particles in the body are oops that stuff's too complicated just remember that creatures drop e uh, ether crystals when they die <laughs> I haven't got the best pot ready don't be shocked this furnace compresses ether crystals and removes impurities uh, ether gems <gasps> no reaction kids these days you don't know what amazing things are I'm still fascinated by Wi-Fi I I don't understand how people don't think Wi-Fi is like the most magical thing in the world. It's like, hey, you have this internet, you plug it into this device, and all of a sudden, boom, the internet is in the air. Like, it just makes sense to people, and it clicks. So you don't think about it, but when you think about it, it's like, it's it's magic. It's literally magic. Uh, you can use the furnaces to make ether gems. You've got the powers of ether crystals, but highly condensed. Those ether gems can give you all sorts of powers. They're great for use in the home or by the defense force. Put them in the weapons or armor with slots. Okay, so they're, you get like upgrade crystal basically. Gems. Uh, it's not much of a reaction. Never mind, it'd probably be quicker for you to try it. If you want to give it a try, just put gems in weapon slots. Weapon of yours will do fine. This is a. So I got strength up and HP up. Cool, he's just giving me stuff. And then I'm going to come back. He's like, hey, you owe me a favor. There's a guy, Billy Bob, down on 4th Street. Um, gems have various qualities. If gem is inserted in a piece of equipment that has a slot, a weapon takes on that quality. Uh, highlight the empty slot on the changer. Okay, this is a, that's, I like this RPG system. I wish Kingdom Hearts needs to add a system like this. I love variables, man. Select the gem you wish to equip. As the story progresses, you will gain the ability to make gems yourself. Okie dokie. Uh, those things are useful, so don't sell them. Look on your face. Looks like you've realized how great they are. I suppose you want to make try making them. You're out of luck. <laughs> you can't. Uh, the ether furnace is broken down. You don't look too bothered. Never mind. Just try coming back later. Uh, okay, so... I think he's done. Okay, so I I I I don't know how to put the slots on or the gems in the slots. I don't understand. <laughs> Am I missing something here? Didn't he literally just tell me? Maybe I, if I watched the video back again, I must have missed a simple dialogue. Oh, Lesky. How's it going? Uh, me and this place, we don't suit each other. And the other residents have become complacent and lazy. I feel like. My frontier spirit is being crushed. Update. Check. Whoa. That's not expecting a whole little load screen here. Affinity chart. Oh, God. Time active, 1800, 300. Male, Homs. He's a Homs. He's 24 years old. That sounds familiar. Dorothy. She's a fine soldier. Personality. What is, oh god. Uh, is estranged free thinker. Liliana. Misses her dad. Oh my god. How. Zoom out. Holy crap. Holy. This. Oh. This gives me a strange premonition of what's to come. <laughs> so it means like a lot of people are going to have these little charts where we look. Uh, talk to them 
Yeah. La 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 la. Hey, Rosemary. Hi there. It's weird. I'm Batman. My heart should be pounding, shouldn't it? I mean, we've been going out long enough for some sparks to fly. But instead, I just feel empty and alone. Am I overthinking things? She talking about this guy? Yes. It's always nice doing my vocal exercises at exercisers. I'm a professional singer, but it's hard to practice during the day. Too many people. Okay. Was Roseberry talking about me? Was she talking about her own boyfriend? Uh, is that wedding ring? Should I just like give it to her? Marry me. It's like I don't even actually know her. <laughs> Ah, uh, it looks like I'm supposed to go this way. Oh my god, this is a very grand place. <laughs> like, you don't expect this kind of a game on a Wii. Hello, little Wazowski. Yeah. yeah! Military district just up ahead. It just pollen orbs throw away. You Homs? I mean, it's just a stone's throw away. Looks like the humans, or the humanoids, are... Feel the power. Affinity coin! So how do levels up how do level up works in this game again? Set up party members and equipment. Oh wait, maybe I go to this menu? No, there's no way I go to this menu, right? Oh I was in the wrong menu the entire time. Ah oh. Then I'm gonna cut out all that. I spent Two, three, four minutes, like trying to figure out how to put slots on. Look at these guys. Could not figure it out. Complete the wrong menu. Actually, now that I think about it, how do level up works? How do levels work in this game? Instead, I got an affinity coin. Quest and other information. Change time. Party. Let me just look at. I guess it's just for changing equipment. Oh my god! I can't. It's everything like visual or am i always gonna look like this well obviously this i'm just asking myself in general i can't i want to find out i love games when like you get a different armor and it actually is a different armor yeah yeah they have good sleep at night they're snoring so loud my sleep not good it's like mini jabba's pack armu yo 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 okay let's actually move on I like actually talking to people. Like I said, I love Mass Effect. Greetings. Arts are learnt naturally. You get stronger to get more arts. More experience also gets you more arts. So then you just naturally earn them at a level. Like you don't... There's no trees or doing specific things. I admire your enthusiasm for your work, but don't overdo it. Okie dokie. So would that be the menu I go in? Arts and skill trees. Oh, there is skill trees. Set up level set and level up arts. Manage skill trees and set up skill links. Well, I can't really use that right now, so I guess maybe I haven't unlocked it. Finally, let's get some more story. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so you get it's a Fallout style. You get experience for every location. Uh, the colony features landmarks, important places and hidden areas and locations places of interest discovering landmarks and locations will ward experience find all the landmarks and locations in an area open up a complete area map okay so that's good to know let me actually look at the map real quick area map see how this looks uh i guess so we get in a section and then go into it Ooh, it's a pretty good map Let's see, how do you zoom out? Toggle, help, move. So there's something over here, something over here. I hit the wrong button. Oh, I was like one step away from out triggering story progression. Are those like cannons or hovercrafts? Or hovercrafts with cannons? It's so peaceful. Come on, stop using this junk sword and get a real sword. You idiots! What the hell are you playing at? Oh, this guy's uh -oh. angry. 
The colonel's gonna explode. Crashing the mobile artillery into a house. How long have you been in the force? Sorry, sir. It's just that we were trying to go as fast as we could, like you ordered. But it's impossible to get back to the military district in only 40 seconds. I don't want any excuses. Champions don't whine. They win. Yes, sir. You're a disgrace to the uniform. Are you forgetting the shame you brought on this force during joint maneuvers with Colony 6? Stick your back into it, maggots! Move it! Yes, sir. Get the artillery back to the military district double time! Then I want a million press-ups from both of you, and you better not stop until your biceps explode! Colonel, we can't move the artillery. What? You better give a damn good reason why. Sir, the impact of the crash damaged the ether conduction cable. The ether fuel proceeded to leak out, and now the cylinder is empty. Well, change the cylinder then. Can't you even do something as simple as that? The auxiliary cylinders have all been used up. It'll be three days until more come in, sir. I told you to keep a stock of fuel in reserve. Sorry, sir. You're nothing but slackers. <laughs> He's just Stay knocks him. Colonel. At this rate, the men will all be dead before they see any action. That was a very animated Colonel. <laughs> I love his pink mustache. Oh my god. See, that's what you need to do, man. If you can't handle, like, deep, like, very subtle movements, make him go nuts. <laughs> oh god, that's great. <laughs> I wonder how much anime this game is gonna be. Uh, two for oh my god, two favorite things combined: Mass Effect and anime. No, Mass Effect is pretty, pretty good anime there. Speaking of which, these uh ships things I just noticed the hovercraft tank things straight out of Star Wars, like almost a hundred percent. These things are like in Star Wars. Who are you, Defense Force Hello. soldier? Hey there, howdy ho! Thanks for modifying my scrap driver for me. It's great, but I'm slightly worried about its defense's capabilities. Um, make me a weapon more suited for defense. What a freaking posh person, man. Like, like, hey, thanks for uh, making me a weapon. Next time, uh, do it better. Andreas. Nothing to report. I know what you're thinking. What a boring job. It's not that bad, really. When you're out and about at this hour, you... On second thought, I'd better not say anything. <laughs> I wonder what he was gonna just admit to, huh? Defense Force Soldier? So he has a little exclamation point. That means he probably has a quest, right? Wait, wait. This... I can't wait. <laughs> I wonder if we're up against a point where we'll have things like this. Let's see. Let's talk to you. What's up? Have you ever been to the pool below Outlook Park at night? There's a monster called Lake... Magdalena that appears there. It would mean a lot if you could eliminate it once and for all. Okay, so challenge three. Is that like our third challenge? Or is that the challenge level for this mission that we are being requested? Defense for Soldier, a curious Defense for Soldier is asking you to defeat the special monster. Defeat Lake Magdala at the park calling number nine. I get three grand, zero experience. But I guess I should just accept it, right? Like, what's the downside? View quest log. Got it? Such courage! Take care and make sure you don't get hot. You're sending me a child in the, what, the four, 15 to 17 years, I'm, I'm guessing? At least I hope. To go fight some kind of monster, and then you're like, yeah, don't get hurt. <laughs> Ooh. Explore. Uh, oh, shady activity going on. Defense Force Soldier, they say she's got a thing for Eric. I heard she even annoys him at lunch. Uh, I can't see what. Get off my screen! What you want? What you want? I'm on my break, <laughs> but I don't know what to do. Monica's always slacking off. I'd never do that sort of thing. Uh, that Monica, where does she get to work? Uh, wait, what? Where does she get to? Huh? Is it true she's been skipping? Oh, hi. Hi. 
I'm only really happy when I'm free to talk like now. I'm fed up of taking care of these useless men all day long. Just two girls chit in the chat. Fed up with things around here. Gotta make a change for the better. I mean, I really, I really should just move on, but I mean, like, exploring is the best. Our second quest already, huh? What's up? Some ridge untolls have appeared outside the commercial district. Think you could go and take care of them for me? We get 800 G's for this. See, Monster Quest 1, Part 1. Okay. Nice one. You get more of them ridge entals around at night. Uh, it's not an easy job, but you should be able to handle it. Okie dokie. So I can go check my missions in that menu. I know how to do that. Is there? I wonder if there's hidden items in this game also where like I go... You know, it's part of my video game logic where I go and... Speaking of which, is this another quest, or is this the same dude? What? What's up? There are a load of cute brogs on the beach near Anti-Air Battery 1. Could you get rid of them for us? Get rid of one for us? The Defense Force is a bit short-staffed at the moment. Didn't you just say cute? Monster Quest 1 Part 2. Oh, okay, I see that's why it has... Yeah, cute brog. I'm gonna go kill something called cute. Can you go kill that bash, that sack full of kittens? It's it's just a hassle. Sorry, I keep asking you for help. Uh, cute brogs are only come out at night, so watch yourself. Yep, just like I said earlier. Oh my god, how many quests are you gonna give us, dude? I hope that the quest menu has side quest and main quest different. There's a bunch of colony crabbles attacking people. They live near Cliff Lake. Can I count on you? 1200 G's. Thanks a lot. Having you like this is having 100 extra troops. Finally, we got them all. Like I said, if like it just goes in the quest log, there's no reason not to like just accept them all at once, right? Monica. Hey, girl. Hi there. There's this guy I really like. You don't know who it is, do you? I have nothing to say. Well then, alrighty. You bitch. Hi, Eric. Hmm. Wait, weren't the girls just talking about this guy? I'm so tired, I should get some sleep. This is the only time I get to rest. Okie dokie. So I go through here. Weapon lab. Yeah, I finally made it here. Doom, doom. What does that say? Mil... Mephameli? Mephameli... Meph... Me me oh my god. Mephamephi. Needs assistance. Mephamephi? Also wants to work close to where she can get materials. Mephamephi wants to move closer to nature. Okie okay, dokie. Okay. Looks like I just missed someone going into his room. <laughs> Get our second cuts in here. So is the colonel going to be in here, or...? Oh, it's the Monado! It's a lot smaller than I thought it was. Alright, Shulk. How are you? Dixon! It's Dixon! When did you get back to Colony 9? <laughs> Just now. I see you've been busy. Looks like your Monado research has been going well. I made the right choice leaving you in charge. How's this guy alive? <laughs> Your research notes really helped. Interesting. So, you can activate it now, then. Well, anyone can activate it. The problem is controlling it. Yeah, for everyone except him. Yes. If anyone other than Dunban were able to control the Monado, we could surpass any military force in the world. How many forces so? are there? What are these hidden functions you mention? It's still only conjecture, but it's starting to look like the Monado might be something far more significant than just a weapon for defeating Mechon. I see. And the evidence to support your theory? It's the symbol that appears in the center when it's activated. What I know is, 
The central piece is made from multi-layered glass. The symbol appears on the top layer, and each layer is constructed differently. So it's possible that other symbols could appear on different layers. Which means... The Monado might conceal even more power. Am I right? Ooh. If we could just... unlock the Monado's power. Don't be too greedy now. Dunban! Dunban! Prioritize the most severely injured! Come on, get a move on! Dunban! <laughs> I love this war zone. Look like that. I haven't come yet. Shulk. Oh, damn it. What'd he tell him? You are my son. <laughs> it's like, Naki? He just looks at the Monado, so it's probably like the Monado. So he was heavily wounded in the victory battle. It was the Monado. It was controlling me. Ah. The Even so, it saved us. Saved our future. Next, it will be up to you. All right, so that's what he told him. Well, I better get the supplies delivered to the defense force. I'll drop round the HQ and see how they're getting on. Okay then. I'll see you later. This game is crazy. Shulk, you're spending too much time in the lab. Either that or rummaging for junk in the scrapyard. It ain't healthy for a kid your age. That's why you're always looking so pasty. You should get out, get some fresh air once in a while. <laughs> All right, I'm off. <laughs> You know, when, when are video games going to add tanning technology, right? Like, if you go out in the sun too long in, like, an open-world game, you actually, character gets a tan. Like, you, you could, if, like, you, if you were always in armor. <laughs> That's the next level, right? Like, they always add stuff. Like, if it was, like, hair, then it's, like, going to be, now it's, like, turning into, like, sweat and, like, tears and, like, water effects on the body, glistening and whatnot. They need to add tanning now. <laughs> well, his arm is... Oh, he's got the shakes, man. He's got the shakes. A bunch of samurai swords. Who is this? Uh, is it time to eat already? You didn't have to bring it yourself. You could have just called me. Don't be silly. Do you want me to feed you? <laughs> Don't treat me like an invalid. I'm better than I was a year ago. Much better. Oh, I really thought I lost you back then. Yes, but now I'm almost well enough to handle the Monado again. Dunban, don't say that. The Meccan have gone now. Oh, why would you say that? I just mean I'm prepared. Sorry. Okay. More importantly, eat up before it gets cold. I made something really special today. Don't feel like you need to stay here then, Fiora. Go and make your next delivery. Huh? Well, I'm sure you'd like Shulk to try some while it's still hot. That's okay. Shulk has no sense of taste. <laughs> He'll say it's delicious even if it's stone cold. <laughs> Very In anime. which case, today he would actually mean it. Hmm, maybe. I'm fine, Fiora. Off you go. Okay. <laughs> I wonder what the relationship here is here, like Don't brother, man. sister. Thanks. Like saved her when she was a child, raised her, part of the family. So his right arm is effed. I like the scarring effect. I, I'm not finished yet. I have to be prepared to use the Monado again. You have another arm. What? I'm playing as another character. Organize party. So X for party. Oh. Fiora. Let's see. She has a hunting knives. 
She's empty. Does it tell me what kind of class she is? Auto attack damage, strength, gives me all of her... Is she messing with her hair? Looks like she doesn't have any... Cut any top. All right! The fact that that happens means that this game is very, uh... You don't freak out. Okay, I'm not having that kind of reaction. Ooh, she's bad already. Oh, she's got moves. She's dipping and dabbing. It lets me know that if I get a new piece of armor, it will change what she looks like. Colony cuffs. These are pretty good. Oh. Thumbs up. I like that a lot. Okay, I would I was so this answered my question in the last episode of like, do you switch? Uh delivering food. Story quest for has made something special for Shulk. Except. Uh, story quest must be completed as a story advances story quest become available Quest will be delayed until the story quest is completed Displayed not delayed uh, Carry the quest so main story will always be the one with the big thing on top Dunban's house She's very fast Running around the table <laughs> Why is she so fast? <laughs> anyway, uh, this has been Kirsten Tia. Thanks for watching. Tune in next time where I deliver some soup. I love the physics on her swords. <laughs> Peace. Mother loving out.